Welcome Cancers, this is the April, May, and June uh, biz reading for career, work, and money. All right, some of you could be business people, could be receiving some sort of a money, some sort of a business offer that is going to be coming up and transpiring. And we have the energy of uh, music and manifestation music and manifestation all right cancers i want to say thank you um to all newcomers thank you for being here thank you for being back um to all newcomers please remember to like and share um thank you to return all um subscription subscriber thank you so much um music and manifestation to manifest rapidly think of your desire while chanting humming, singing, or playing music. All right. So we see a lot of money is coming up and a lot of money is going to be transpiring and it's coming up. But the situation here, um, what we're seeing is that your hardship or whatever situation would work in business, especially business people, your hardships is going to be over. As we look in the cup, um, and seeing the major issues is that uh, I see your heartbreaks is in the reverse. A lot of you Scorpion had a whole lot of heartbreaks. Um, a whole lot of you can, um, cancers are going to be balancing some sort of an issue and situation at the work floor with an Aquarian and a Libran. Um, a whole lot of you cancers have some sort of a problem with a Virgo. A Virgo is now investigating and looking at a situation with you cancers. Um, a Virgo is recognizing um, and seeing some sort of a situation with your business or with your work. Some sort of information is going to be coming out. And uh, um, business people, I see that this is going to be good for you. Now, um, working people, the energy of the magician is here. And the energy of the magician is showing up uh, something about your colleagues. Or your colleagues are going to be giving out some sort of a information about you cancer. So, um, some of you cancers could be getting some sort of a... A salary increase or moving up uh, the ladder this is coming up because the energy of the magician is here you have two major um situation and a major situation in this quarter is about the energy of uh, um, number 17 17 is eight and there is the energy of manifestation so a lot of you cancers who have business um by manifesting new clients uh, um um, new business offers, new orders coming in. This is going to be good for you in the spirit because you're going to be creating a lot of financial stability. Um, a whole lot of you at, on the work floor had some sort of a problem with a scorpion and with a Libran. A lot of you um, uh, cancers had problem with a scorpion and a Libran. Whatever this problem is, I see um, the scorpion and a lot of you have a whole lot of issues with employees. And we're going to be looking at who you're going to be having problems with. First, we see the energy of the Gemini. The Geminis are going to be winning over you, Cancers. Then we see a situation with the Scorpions that is transpiring. Um, then we see the Librans. Um, a lot of you are going to be dealing with the Aquarians. The Virgos are here. The Taurus are here. But the Virgos are kind of double. There's some sort of a double energies that you cancers are dealing with virgos um however this is coming up and is transpiring a lot of you cancers are going to be having some sort of issues and problems with virgos so if virgo people are your boss or virgo people on the work floor a lot of problems and issues are going to be coming up for you cancer so be aware of that so the energy of eight infinity is here and a lot of you cancers are going to be heartbroken um, over at, at the work, over something to do with your work, because some sort of a, a information is going to be coming out. So the magician um, is here to help a lot of you cancers to manifest. So if you cancers have been out of work for quite some time or your business has been taking a hit, um, this is uh, the portal that you're going to be manifesting and bringing back some sort of a um, stability in your worlds. If you recognize only one card is in the upright and it is the energy of the manifester. And this energy of the manifester is saying, hey, cancers, 
I know you have not been having it very easy, but guess what? It is about you recognizing and using your power in order to create and manifest things in your life and is going to be recognizing of what is happening and transpires. So cancers, I see an energy comes up that they're going to be finding out something that some of you cancers have done. So whatever that is happening and transpiring, they're definitely going to be recognizing what you cancers have done. Um, some of you cancers could have created some sort of issues that affect other people on the work floor. And I see that now they're going to be recognizing that you cancers have been creating some sort of a chaos um, around you or people have been creating chaos around you cancer so it's vice versa it's a thing with vice versa it is not a good time in this um, third quarters to create any possible situation okay it's not a good time whatever is happening and transpiring a lot of people are going to be recognizing and is going to be seeing the um, creation of what is transpiring and this is going to be good um so cancers this three months um is um this is the energy of uranus uranus but uranus is coming in you have the uranus energy um you have it for the quarter and you have it in the month of april and there is some sort of information that is going to be coming out about you cancers whatever that has been happening and transpiring you're going to be recognizing some sort of information about you cancers however this is going to be coming up they're going to be recognizing and seeing so the cancers is as if some sort of a changes is going to be coming up and it's going to be affecting some of you cancers um it can be in a good a uh, good or a positive, um, a good manner for a lot of you, but for some of you, it can be changes that you were not open for. So, um, cancers, you gotta be recognizing and opening up yourself and recognizing that there can be changes, and however these changes come up, you have to deal with these changes in a performed way that is going to be helping you to understand and recognize. Uh, um, what is coming up to create some sort of a stability for you in your world and this is going to be um, good. So a lot of uh, amazing, amazing transition is going to be coming up and this amazing transition is going to be bringing some sort of a transpar transpiration where changes is definitely going to be coming up. So, you know, you got to be recognizing and opening up yourself as to what has been transpiring in your world in order to uh, facilitate uh, the things that is transpiring around you and this is going to be good. So you need to focus. It's about uh, being focusing at this time and uh, um, having clear, um, April is going to be, um, you're, you know, you're having clear thoughts uh, and that is going to be good because a lot of you cancers need to focus in the month of April for whatever is happening and transpiring. So um, we are recognizing and seeing um, changes, possibilities uh, um, that is going to be coming up. So when we look, there's a lot of money to be made and Whoever were is, was in hardship, so I see you're going to be coming out of this hardship because a lot of you are going to be recognizing how to make a lot of money. And this is going to be good. This is really, really going to be good. So uh, in however way um, it is happening and to inspire, a lot of you are going to be recognizing that it is time... <coughs> <coughs> <clears throat> time to face the truth and time to recognize that whatever changes is coming up take the changes because it's going to be creating a whole lot of financial stability in your world and it's going to be bringing you back to some sort of a specific changes that is going to be coming up and transpiring so that is going to be good so it is going to be a wonderful alignment of energies. However, you, however way you look at this, you're going to be seeing that a positive alignment of energies is going to be coming up. That is going to be 
creating a whole other transition in your world and it is going to be creating positivity where money is going to be flowing in so cancers this is like a powerful powerful alignment of energies however you are looking at this cancers you are going to be working out the issue so so um um uh, there is something that is going to be coming up uh, with co-workers that co-workers at place you in a hard spot a hard place in your life your co-workers have been working against a lot of you cancers and you're going to be recognizing this so then we see heartbreaks that some of you were heartbroken about a situation that has to do with uh, um, your work, finance, or career, you were or broken, but um, it's as if new work is going to be coming in. So that is going to be viable for a lot of you cancers. Then when we look at uh, um, the hardship, a lot of you um, have been out of a job for a very long time. And a lot of you are going to be finding ways to create new stability in your world and this is going to be good so a lot of you who were out of a job for a very long time you're going to be recognizing how to create some sort of a new stability a lot of you that was having issue with your co-workers on the work floor this is going to be over okay this is definitely going to be over so a lot of you had um problems and issue with an aquarian um a uh, Leo and Aquarian, a the Taurus. A lot of you were having issues with these people, and this is going to be over. A lot of you were heartbroken or broken from some sort of a issue that you were having with a Libra, a Taurus, um, um, so another Cancer, and a Aries, and this is going to be also over so it, it is it's a period of transition um that is transpiring and you know changes at the work floor is going to be coming up changes in the department is going to be coming up changes in the team is going to be coming up but this is going to be leaving a lot of you with a lot of positive energy um if you're making meetings one o'clock um and uh, eight o'clock in the morning is going to be good three o'clock in the afternoon is going to be good um so within these times whoever is making meetings um or having um, uh, um you know applying for a jobs and that sort of a thing um those times is going to be good but you know recognize that uranus is here and when uranus is here uranus is about to um, create some sort of a changes and when Uranus comes up it's as if these changes are needed to me making in your work and career um, feel and um, a lot of you could be thinking about changing your career in whatever way it is a whole lot of you are going to be thinking about making um, career changes so be aware of this so I want to say to you cancers it is good to become a member of the channel um, and why is it is that there is a lot of information in the archive you can go back and look at certain um, co-workers that you're dealing with on the work floor to find out you know what has been going on with them and to see how they look at you so you know it is as, it's as advisable for a lot of you cancers to go and become a member use the medium subscription the medium subscription give you and show you a lot okay because with a medium subscription everyone is going to be receiving this and a medium subscription is we're really going to be giving you information about other people um and by going in the archive you can access uh, other people and see what is going on in other people life okay so let's um look at this period as a, a transition period for you cancers it's about teaching you to learn to manifest in your world and to recognize what it is that you're missing why you are not having this positive flow in your career work or business and it's because you need to make 
some sort of a changes. And as you recognize that these changes are going to be coming up and you're going to be making the right changes. I do love you, um, cancers, whatever is happening and transpiring. I hope to see you on the other side. If not, I will speak to you later.